Hey everyone, I'm back. It's been a while since I've done one of the updates with the GoPro, but just wanted to say that everything's going pretty good. We've had a fun end to winter here. Spring is right around the corner, it's starting to get warm outside, which is really nice. We're definitely enjoying that. So um, one of the big reasons that I wanted to do the vlog in 2019 is because we were having some big changes for our family this year. And one of the biggest changes is that we're having a baby and we're super excited about that. So this past weekend, uh, Lisa and I had a fun time in Harrisburg for a little date night on Friday. And then Saturday we had a big community day event at our church. So we invited community members to come out and had some free food and free games for families, which was a fun time. But the exciting thing that we did on Saturday was that we had Lisa's 20 week ultrasound done. So we will find out the gender of the baby this weekend, which we're really excited about. But what we just found out today, which was some interesting news, is that Lisa has something called placenta priva, I think is how it's pronounced. And basically that means the placenta is covering the cervix, something along those lines. So she can't exercise, can't squat, do um, too much movement. So they want her to, to rest and take it easy. And uh, hopefully she'll be able to do that. I'll do my best to, to coach her through that because I know that's going to be tough for her to, to rest and take it easy. But, you know, when you when you find out something like that and then you start to look at the internet and just to see what that means for Lisa and also the baby, it can be a little bit scary. I think, you know, the baby's fully healthy. We got that good news, which was great. But uh, certainly there's some other complications that can happen in the pregnancy. So it's something that we just want to be aware of and that we need to know about. And obviously with going to Italy next week with Lisa's family, she can't do a ton of walking. So it's going to be a different trip for her maybe than what we were hoping for. So in the midst of all this news, we know that God is in control and we're just totally trusting him with our baby's life. And we know that this child is going to do some great things for God's kingdom, and we're really excited and just praying over this baby, and we just tra trusting God with their life. But it definitely it it hit it hits close to home when things like that when you hear things like this or when when you get news like this, I should say. So we're just going to lift this up to God. We trust Him. Uh, pr pray over Lisa and the baby's life during this time. And we're, we're both super excited to become parents, and we just know that God is in control. So yeah, I just wanted to give you a quick update on what's been going on. Uh, hopefully in 10 years we can look back at this and just be reminded of this time and how we just knew God was in control, and we surrender this to Him. And, you know, we have a fully healthy and happy child at that point, but um, we're, we're excited and going to do my best. I know I've, I've failed on doing some of these updates here where I'm talking to the camera because I do think that it has helped somewhat with public speaking and I want to continue to do this to try and refine that skill. So yeah, we'll keep working on that, but uh, we'll, we'll keep living life and trusting God and super excited to see what the rest of 2019 brings.